Okay, this is Dan Gasway once again with the Pitching Academy. Today I'm going to talk about a circle change and the common misconceptions with this pitch. First of all, let's talk about the grip. The first thing you want to do, what I like to do, um, is make sure my thumb and middle finger split the baseball in half. I actually throw more of a C change. It's close to a circle. So this is going to be a C change because that uh, my index finger, my thumb make a C. That's a real circle change. But I seem to have a, a lot more control of this pitch uh, when my thumb and middle finger are splitting the baseball in half. Okay. So once that's done, I find my circle. And this is a great beginning pitch when you're learning how to throw the circle change. Um, or a, a good beginner grip right there. That C change is better than the circle change. When you put your fingers down here and you make a circle, what happens if you're, if you're first starting to learn this pitch, what will happen is it will put pressure, more pressure with your middle finger uh, on that thumb. So it's harder to find control with that pitch. So that's why I just have all the beginning pitchers when they're learning this pitch just to do a C. Um, one of the common things when throwing this pitch, one of the common errors is once, once a pitcher learns this grip, they just throw it like a fastball and they'll slow down their arm. Okay? When throwing any other pitch, you've got to have fastball arm speed and fastball, the same fastball arm slot that you have. Okay? In any other pitch that you throw, your circle change will not be deceiving to any batter if you're just throwing slower, okay? Especially when you get on the high school levels, collegiate level, they'll just, they'll just laugh at you, okay? So find that circle change, the C change grip. Once you find the C change grip, as you're going towards home plate, you've got to make sure that C is actually pointing toward the catcher, okay? Most pitchers when they learn, hey, I know how to throw a circle change, they really don't because they'll just grip it. They might grip it the right way, but they'll just throw it just like a fastball. Yeah, it might slow down if their arm speed goes slower, okay? And, you know, the more fingers that you have on the baseball, the slower that's going to go. However, it's not going to dive on you like a good circle change does. So, again, find the grip. Make sure that that C is pointing toward home plate as you're coming through. And then as you end, you want to end like this. You know, I'll turn around and show you. You want to end right here as opposed to right here as a fastball. So you're going to be right down there. So just make sure that that C is pointing towards home plate as you throw it. 